from VOA Learning English. This is the Technology Report. Technology students in New Jersey answered a challenge. The U.S. Department of Defense wanted someone to build an underwater robot. The students are with the Stevens Institute of Technology in Hoboken, New Jersey. They successfully designed and built a robot for uncovering unexploded mines at the bottom of the sea. The underwater vehicle is called Perseus II. The students recently tested Perseus II in a 95 meter long tank of water at the Stevens Institute of Technology. The robot costs about $15,000 to build. The students use a video game controller to direct its movements. Devices known as thrusters enable the robot to go up, down, and toward its target in the water. Video cameras on the robot send images back to a computer through a 13 meter long cable. Perseus II also has a set of lasers. They are used to measure the size of an object. The robot is the creation of five undergraduate students. They worked over six months to design and build Perseus II. Michael DeLorne supervised the project. He says the specialized requirements of the robot were demanding. For example, it has to determine if an object in the water is dangerous or not. Michael DeLorne says the students had resourceful solutions for difficult problems, like how to control the position of the robot while underwater. They also developed a low-cost method to mark the location of whatever objects they found. Perseus II was successfully tested in Florida with similar robots built at other engineering schools. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Persuti.